What is going on everybody? DJ Goham here. Welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are having a great day. Oh yeah. So we've, uh, <laughs> we're back. Oh, that's right. We are back and we are rocking and rolling. And what we've got is we've got our headlands done and hopefully that will make sure that this, oh yes, this can work correctly. Now I know it's going to take it two or three passes. So that is cool with me. Next things next. We need to get this, and we have got to clean up the cows. Now, this thing is pretty sweet. Uh, it, uh, well, <laughs> rocks at 8 miles an hour, which sucks. But then again, with one of these, you're not running around very fast anyway. So it's fine. Meh. It'll work. <laughs> we, may, uh, we may not keep this for very long. What I thought about doing is going and picking up the... Uh, Oh gosh, what, what is it? The, 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 the Lieber telehandler. Oh, I love that thing to death. Thought about buying one of those. Let me know what you think down in the comment section below. What? You guys were whining and complaining about this? God, you guys suck. Is that all the way down? Yeah, there we go. Ay, 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 ay. Cows, 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 cows. What the problem is. Get y'all dumped out. You whining and complaining about everything. There we go. See, now you're clean. And seeing that this is the only job that this does... I'm going to put it right there. Oh, yeah. So, next thing's next. we got to get this area straightened up, cleaned up, all that good stuff. Now, in the last video, I asked you guys, I said, Hey, who wants me to get the new cow additions? and use those on the cow farm here. And there was not a single person. Hope we're being blocked by an object. I bet they are. Uh-huh. Let me guess. You stuck in the trees? Nope, just against them. What a dummy. <laughs> Gosh, this guy's an idiot. Got all the way down. Here I am talking good things. And they do that. Oh, boy, oh, boy, oh, boy. You know what? Just, just do a pass and get it over with. Here we go. So it was an overwhelming, yes, 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 get the cow additions. So what we've done is we borrowed a little bit of money. And today we will be buying the Valtra. Ooh, go crazy with the camera. We'll be buying the Valtra T series cow edition and the Valtra N series cow edition. And we will be using those on our cow farm. That is right. So, what are some other vehicles that you guys think they'd be like, yo, nobody's using this, I think it would be cool, you should get this. Let me know down in the comment section, that's what I want to know today. What are some... Trees? What are some vehicles and implements, that kind of thing, stuff that you don't see anybody using, no YouTubers, anything like that, or just in general, people that you're playing with. What are some things that you, and I swear if somebody says that the, uh, the Fiat, oh, I'm just dumb. You know, you know about me and the Fiat. It's just not my favorite tractor. And by not my favorite tractor, I don't wanna. <laughs> I don't wanna, you can't make me. What I do like is this AD340 right here. Man, this thing is nice. I love it, I love it, I love it. Ooh, we got some eggs. I thought about waiting until we had a bunch of eggs and then taking those. Then again, should we get more chickens? See, we don't we don't have a lot of uh, we don't have a lot of room over here anymore. One thing we could do, and I've debated doing this, but I think with the way the trees are, we may run into problem, is moving this area here, taking this whole area and uh, chopping it, and then putting down another chicken pen, so we can get more eggs. I don't know if that's a good idea or not. You let me know what you think. Leave it, take it, whatever. Um, I love seeing the ideas that you guys have and your your opinions on things and stuff like that. I think it's really cool. So what we're going to do here is we're going to completely ditch this sprayer. Don't get me wrong. I am sure that this sprayer works awesome. If you guys are doing this on your own, if you have humongo fields where you can turn around nice and easy, go for it. You ain't hurting nobody. But DJ getting real irritated about it. So let's boom in a little bit so we can see. There we go. 
and grab a hold of one of these because this is what we're going to do now. We're going to just throw some solid fertilizer on the other two, just enough to get it done. That way we can get our two states of fertilizer and be completely finished. Now someone in the last video mentioned that you can put down slurry and, uh, and manure any time, or at least slurry. So I'm interested to know about that. I'm interested to see how that works. But in the meantime, we've got to get this taken back to the store because we need to return it. Now, can we hook up to this? Yes, we can. Perfect. Ooh, there's a little bit of weight on the back of this thing. Let's take this on back to the store and we are going to get some Valtra N and T series cow additions for the cow farm. One thing I want to try real quick, because I can't remember if you could... Now, oh, of course it puts it over there. Great. That ought to be fun to try and move. Let's see. I can't remember if you can sell liquid fertilizer down here or not. Here, sell. Nope. Can't do a darn thing with it. So now we've got to figure out how to... You know what? I ain't even going to try and figure out how to get rid of it. All I'm going to do is we're just going to load it back up. If we can. Oh, yo, is it not going to let us load? Yo, we might not be able to load with this thing. Let's see if I can turn the wheels just so, get close over to it. There we go. So we're going to load it up and then sell it. Be done with it. Boom, boom, boom. Cow additions coming right well, now. Yes, drop that off. Cow additions coming out. Ooh, inside of the building. Bam, bam, bam. Return. Yes, please. Thank you very much. And it is gone. Now, for the fun what you've all been waiting for and what you're here for. The Valtra, oh yeah, the N-Series. We are going all the way with these. Uh, I am going to keep rim color white with one. I'll probably do black with the other. Uh, a couple people have mentioned pink, green, all that crazy, crazy, crazy colors. Uh, I'm not... Yeah, it's cool. I mean, I mean, should we? Should we just go green with one and like pink with the other? How about that? Let's just go pink with the little one and let's go uh, green with the uh, the other one. We'll go silly pea green. Give him a nice little shout out over here. All right, so tr do we go trailer borgs, Nokians? Eh. You know, let's do... Actually, no, these are going to be used for grass work, so we don't need those. Let's go with just standard wheels on this one. Uh, I don't think we need a big engine with this one, so let's just stick with the normal 145 horsepower engine. It's going to be more than enough. And a front loader. Yes, bye, please, and thank you. Now we need front loader stuff for that. One needs to have a bucket. The other one needs to have stuff for doing bales. So this is going to be the bucket. So we're going with the FC30. This is the pink one. So we're going to go with the pink. Goodness gracious, this is so weird. Look at it. And uh, let's see. Let's get us a universal bucket. Also pink. Bam, bam, bam. Gosh. And now <laughs> let's go into medium tractors. Let's find the T. There it is. Cow Series T edition. Rim color. Silly P green. And let's go with a rear wides with uh, weights. Actually, can we do? That's nah, just too much. That's just too too much tractor going on right there. Uh, engine, we need to go 210 or 250. I think 210 is going to be perfectly fine here. And then, of course, stick another front loader on there. Boom, boom, boom. Got that. Let's get out of there. Back to front loaders. We're going to stick the FC60 on here. Paint that one green. Purchase. Yes, please. Thank you very much. And before I forget, let's go pallet forks because I like using pallet forks for bales. It's just the way I am. Uh, what if I let you guys talk me into this is in no oh, helpers done with uh, something that they're doing Well, that's good. Let's go ahead and stick you on the another field real quick get this completely finished up Yeah, get out of here birds Oh, yeah, 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 if we get merch, that's gonna have to be one of the things <laughs> just get out of here birds Ooh, This one's a lot bigger than I thought it was look at this thing. I mean, I know it's a t-series But dang t-series no, no, no. PewDiePie's way better. What? No, I have no idea what I'm talking about. Anyway, back to where we are. All right. 
There's one. Bam, bam, bam. Uh, we probably do need to get a trailer to take that over. Let's jump into bailing technology, see what we can get into here. Um, you know, I think we're just going to do another cotton trailer. It worked pretty well the first time around with the exception of me being a complete idiot with it. At least that. Grab a hold of here and we'll just drive this up on here. If you guys have not used these like this before, actually, you know what? We should have done the animal trailer way cheaper. We'll do it another time. It'll be all right. Got that. Bam, bam. Lower. <laughs> Somebody had said pink down in the comment section of the last video. You know we had to go pink with it. We had to. Line this up just nice. So, got it. Goodness gracious. What have I let you guys let me do? <laughs> well, fortunately, I change, uh, change tractors more than most people change tractors. So this would not be too bad. We'll back it up on there. Raise the arms. Back it in. Yeah. Oh, man. Ooh, we're sliding. Look out. No, no. Wrong way. Brakes. Boom. Hop in. Ooh, it's heavy. And there you have it. There's our new tractors. Sweet. All right. These are going home. Let's get these home over to the cow farm. Here they are in their natural habitat already. Also, Jim, I'm trying to record. Stop. <laughs> you know what you're doing. <laughs> Give me a break, man. Oh, big shout out to Alien Jim. We got some cool stuff happening with Mercury Farms. Um, I think we're pretty close to being ready to do some final testing. So that is really, really cool. Wow, this is handling these bells way better than that 700 was. Oh my goodness, well, those rear weights were a good idea as well. We're going to put these to work right away, getting some power food done. But, yes, uh, Alien Jim's Mercury Farms 4 FS19 um, is nearing completion. Uh, so we got some fun stuff going on with that. And we'll be able to give you guys some information soon. As soon as, uh, well, as soon as it's available to be given out, I reckon. Here we go. There's that, there's that. Bam, bam, bam. A couple people had asked me about Mercury Farms, saying, you know, what's the difference between 17 and 19? And the short answer to that is almost everything. The animal pens, the ground, the sky, the lighting, the, the everything, <laughs> the scenery. Uh, it's a brand new map. Uh, there were some, uh, some issues uh, converting things over, from my understanding. So what Jim did was he just made a map there you go it's like Merc mercury 19 but awesome so now we need to get some hay in here all the way up to 12,000 there we go and then finish it off with a little bit of straw bam now a lot of people have asked too you know about power food and and that thing and power food works exactly the same way in 19 as it did in 17 so you don't actually need to add straw oh i forgot this thing was in the way so I want to keep this. Yo, do these open? They do not. I want to keep this, but I don't have a whole lot of reason to, other than the fact that we can just clean up over here. I don't know. Maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just me. Jump in here. There we go. Nice, nice, nice. But, uh, no, you just need, you know, one-third to two-thirds parts uh, hay and silage to do power food. Straw is just filler, and at that point, you want to break it up into four sections. Uh, so you want to have, uh, or you can do fifths if you really wanted to. Um, I did uh, two-fifths silage, two-fifths hay, and one-fifth straw. That was back when I was kind of making a whole lot of it. Uh, that was just my go-to. See, how are, we, how are we looking on silage now? Yeah, silage, TMR, 55,000, not too bad. We are going to finish using up the silage bells that we have over here. Not today, but eventually. We will finish up using these. And then what we're going to do is we're going to swing in and uh, we're going to just buy silage bells from there on out. I don't see any reason to keep making Well, I say making them. You guys know how we rock with money over here. You know how we rock with money. Yo, how's straw? They get, they get on straw? 
Yeah, they're good on straw. So could use a little bit of water, but they're all right. So there you go. There are the Valtra N and T series. Cow editions. Ugh, saying T series just makes you feel dirty, doesn't it? Ugh. Uh, say it again. T series. It's some lasagna, if you know what I'm talking about. <laughs> All right, let's get these put away. What we're going to do now is we're going to head back over. The other field should be done fertilizing, at least by this point it should be. So hopefully it is. And we're going to get over there. We're going to put everything away and maybe have a little bit of fun. Looks like we are all done over here. We're going to get this dropped off. And we've got one more thing we need to do. Now, some people have asked me about doing forestry. And I have said, meh. <laughs> I've, been, I've been very mad about it to be completely honest with you uh, but it's not really fair so here's what we're going to do we are going to buy a brand new plot of land and we are going to plant some trees we're going to plant some saplings there so we are going to pick up pallet saplings we're going to pick up a planter and we are going to take a planter up there so Let's go ahead and get those gotten. Now let's head over to Loggy right there. There we go. Oh, it's the first one. Look at that. Bam. And we want to lease that. Yes. And then pallet saplings. Boom, boom, boom. Pallets. Pallet saplings. Bam, bam, bam. That is what I want. So we've got that. We've got everything we want and need. Well, where are we going to do it? We are going to buy field three right up by the sawmill right beside it the field is grass so it's uh well kind of looks like there'd just be trees in a field so we're gonna buy that we don't have a whole lot of money left 14 grand that is it but you know what it's okay because we now will have some pallet saplings bam load those up Ooh, front's looking a little uh <laughs> front's looking a little not low isn't it you know what? We may actually have to get a weight for once. Bam, 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 bam. I don't think we need to go too crazy with it. Uh, let's see. The Agco weights. Can we paint these a different color? Navy. I don't even know what color the thing is. Uh, it's like a shiny blue. Shiny blue. Do we have shiny blue? Shiny blue! Is that what that is? That gold hover? It's pretty shiny blue. I think that's about right. Let's uh, let's check that other color just real quick. The navy. Oh, that's not it. All right, I think it's that. Let's lease. Bam, bam, bam. Is that about right? Hey, that's about right. Not completely, but close enough. There we go. And yeah, the perfect weight too. Awesome. Let's head up to field three. right as soon as I quit hitting stuff. <laughs> Alright, we are here. I just gotta find where the field starts. Ooh, field starts back here. Yikes, yikes. Back it up, back it up, back it up. I think I see it. You know, you can always kind of tell where it starts, and it starts right here. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get close, about right there. Hopefully we can set a worker. We do need to go in and make sure worker buy everything is on, and it is. So, maybe we're too far over. <laughs> Let's see, how's about now? Nope. Nope. Dang, I gotta figure this out. What if we go here? Nope, crap. <laughs> There's gotta be a way to make this work. Here's what I'm thinking. 
I'm thinking maybe because there's grass that it recognizes that there's a crop in here already. And so it can't plant the tree. So what I'm thinking is we cultivate the grass up. And in doing so, hopefully trick it into thinking that everything is good. That is the question though. Will that work? Will this work? But to find out, I do want to get as close as I can to the edge. Come on, just work. That's all I want you to do. Yes! Pallet saplings in the ground. Let's go, baby! That one's not even in <laughs> that one's not even in the field. Come on. <laughs> Well, we are rocking, we are planting, and everything is feeling all right. This is a very, well, I say a very big field. It's actually, probably our smallest field that we own. Uh, but still, nonetheless, we've got a lot of work to do. We've got not a whole lot of money to do it with. So we're going to attempt to get it all done as quickly as possible. Ought to be fun. But guys, that is going to be it for today. I hope you've enjoyed. If you did, please drop a like. If you didn't, make sure you just smack that dislike button. If you haven't, make sure you subscribe. And if you have any questions for me, leave them down in the comment section. I'll be happy to help you guys out. That being said, hope you guys have a great day. And we will see you later. Peace.